Well, I said the other day that as far as I'm concerned, that uh, they have uh, Michael's blood on their hands and they know what they've done. And there's people out there who've, who could have helped, who could have stepped in, but didn't do for financial reasons. But as far as I'm concerned, when that autopsy report is, comes out, you know, I, I know in the back of my mind exactly what the situation is. And, and I've, I've, what do you think it will show? I think it will show that he accidentally was, was given too much or taken too much of a painkiller. Uh, or some type of st of um, relaxant, coupled with maybe an, an upper to to get him up to to perform on that particular day, and his heart was given several messages: slow down and to speed up, and he didn't know what to do, and it just stopped. Uh, it happened, I understand this happened to numerous celebrities in the past, and that was always the fear that 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 this would happen, you know. But we we were hoping um, me and the brothers were, were hoping that he would he would see sense and and would come back but he just completely isolated himself you know he just stayed in constant contact with his mother but he was brainwashed by the people that were around him he had and no one would tell him the truth